Okay, guys, welcome back. This is a quick demo for the two apps I mentioned. One is Vox Gun, and the second one is Headline. I'm going to run you through Vox Gun. Now, Vox Gun basically allows you to add voiceovers to your videos without you doing the speaking. So, all you need to do is type out the words, and then the app will do the speaking for you using whatever voice it is you select, right? So, you just head over to voxgun.com and then click on Join Now. It's free. Um, I'm just going to sign in because I already have an um, account with them, right? So now this is what your dashboard will look like. You're going to have a couple of projects here, um, shared projects. So I'm, going to, I'm going to add a new project. So I'm going to call this um, test. It's basically I'm supposed to show you like a demonstration, right? So we have text, uh, personal text. Uh, okay, so. You have, um, is there a video in there? Okay, let's just, I'm just going to delete that, right? So I'm going to select landscape, which is um, your video size, essentially. So you're going to have this add scene button here. So just click on that. It's going to ask you what kind of scene do you want to add. Just select text, right? Um, Um, just select text, right? And then select, enter the text for your scene here. That's it. So you see a box that looks like this. Um, the grayed out box at the top says update preview. Then underneath, you're going to see voiceover script. This is where you type in your actual words. So I'm going to type in words from the video we created in the demo, right? So it starts with your head is damaging your spinal cord. Right, and you don't even know it. Okay, so we have one. So I'm going to add a second scene and um, slide this forward. What are the next words that we wrote? Okay, so we started to explain. I think the next words we wrote, we bend our heads. Okay, so the same thing click on text, click on the text scene, type, type in there, and then say we bend our heads when we use our smartphones and computers um, okay so we can go to the next one same thing text and type this causes neck and back pain which can eventually require corrective surgery to fix right so i'm just going to use this that part as a demo of course you can go on and do the whole thing so now if i click on update preview it's going to upload these words i've typed to the server now listing and you're going to hear the software the ai repeat those words back to you like a human being was actually saying it so i'm going to click on sally here this is where you change the voices they give you two voices for free and then you can buy a lot of other but you can work with the two voices i think they're fine so it's an english accent then you have sally which is a robotic female voice and then you have matthew which is a robotic male voice so you can pick any of them i'm going to go with matthew and then i'm going to close this now what i'm going to do next is click on preview it's going to bring out the small box it says um you made some changes update preview and i'm going to say yes so what it does is it takes these three different scenes and combines them into one scene you can see each of the scenes has about six to about five to six seconds each scene but the total video will probably be about um somewhere in the neighborhood of 15 to 16. so let's play and listen just what it sounds like your head is damaging your spinal cord and you don't even know it. We bend our heads when we use our smartphones and computers. This causes neck and back pain which can eventually require corrective surgery to fix. Your head is damaging your spinal cord and you don't even know it. We bend our heads when we use our smartphones and computers. This causes neck and back pain which can eventually require corrective surgery to fix. 
that's it. That's how you turn your text into voice. So you can download this file and then of course extract the audio and then add it to your whatever it is you're doing. So you can have it playing this causes like in the background of what you're doing, right? So that's how you turn text into voiceovers without having to do the speaking yourself. So if you don't like the sound of your voice, that's an option to go. So I'm going to quickly jump into the next app, which is um, Headliner. Headliner, like I explained earlier, allows you to add transcriptions, text transcriptions to your video. What that basically means is, you know the small text that appears underneath your video, right? You need that for your Facebook ads so that your ads make sense even if the audience or the listener is watching that video in silent mode, which a lot of people do, right? So you don't want them thinking, what is this one talking about? And then swiping away. You want them to actually make sense of what you're saying. So when this, this is, um, okay, let me log in so you see what it looks like. Just go to headliner.app, not headliner.com, headliner.app. Once you get there, sign up. It's a free app. It's a free web app. You sign up. I want to sign up. This is what you're going to see, the dashboard, right? You're going to see Audiogram Wizard. Article to video, video transcript, straight to editor. And if you click on this little arrow down here, you see full episode and my content. The particular one we want to use is the video transcript, which is what allows you to upload a video and then convert the, the words that are spoken in that video into text, right? So we choose the square, that's the aspect, aspect ratio we want. And then it says drag and drop your video or choose the file. So I'm going to choose the file I just recorded a few seconds ago. Uh, where do we save it? I think we saved it on the desktop. Um, a second. Screencast. Okay, so we recorded this. Um, that's a few seconds before we share this. So this is what it looks like. Um, then we'll change. Let me change the aspect ratio so you see the full video. So that's the video. We select the language. Transcription language is English by default. So just leave it at that and then click on next. So that's the video. You can play it to make sure. Okay, hello guys. This is a quick test. Just to show you how the transcription service or headliner works, right? I'm going to take this this video and then I'm going to upload it into the headline and then I'm going to see it turn it into transcribed text right down the video. Right. Okay, so that's our video, right? So you can trim it here. If you don't want to use the entire video, you can use a portion of it. So I'm, I think I'm just going to do that and trim it to about um, here. Let me see. Okay. So about that. So that's fine. So I'm going to say create project. Now what it's going to do is it will upload that video clip to the server. And then the server will try and transcribe the vocals in the video into words, right? But it's also going to show you so that you can correct because it's not always perfect. Sometimes you can make mistakes and um, and transcribe the wrong thing. So the edit feature will allow you to correct the mistakes that are made and then save them back into the file so this will take a while i'll just let it finish and then i'll show you how it looks when it's done okay so our video is done uploading so let's see what it transcribed now i'm already seeing some errors here <laughs> well you can see the text there right so let's play this and see I was listening to Jonathan, so he wasn't getting what he was saying. He said, you need to drive. Let me see what he said again. You need to drive like two buildings. So I can just click here, and then I'm correcting now, right? So I'm correcting. I'm saying you need to drive for like two buildings. I'm not sure what he was, what he was actually saying. Let me play that again. Okay, 
hello guys so you can see that hello guys just to show you how the transcription service or headline will work right so i'm going to take this, this video and then i'm going to upload it to the headline and then you'll see it on it into transcribed text right then with the text so it's a little bit confusing because two people are talking at the same time. Ideally, it should just be you talking. Okay, hello guys. This is a quick test just to show you how to. Okay, so. So, hello guys. What? This is a quick test just to show you how the transcription service for for headliner works right Uh, well, as I'm doing this edits and I'm saving it, it's transcription a service or headline or work, right? So I'm, I'm going to take this, this video and then I'm going to upload it to. Okay, right? So I ask the question, right? So, I'm going to take this video. And I'm um, going to upload it into Headliner. I think that's what I said. Was that? So just click anywhere and then it saves. So let's play again and see. Headliner, and then you'll see it on it into transcribed text right under the video. Right. And then you're going to see it on it. And then you're going to see it turn it into transcribed text right there on the video. Right? So that's it. So now let's assume I'm going to delete all this. I don't want this one. I don't know what I was saying there, but this is enough for the demo, right? So if we play this, you can see the text showing up right here. To show you how the transcription service. I'm going to take this, this video and then I'm going to put it into here. Did you see that? Now, of course, you can come to posters, you can come to style and then change the style for the captions. There are a lot of styles there. And see bold, which makes it bolder. So it depends on what you want. And see italic speech. You can see large headings if you want it to cover. Of course, you don't want it to cover. But. The idea is you can you can use different types of and I'm going to just leave the default and then I'm going to cancel it. So once you're done with this, now once I hit export, my email address, the video quality, the size, blah blah blah, and let's hit export. It's gonna upload all of this video audio and everything to the cloud and then send you an email when the video is ready. Now your final video is gonna look like this. It's gonna it's gonna have your video playing and then you're going to have the packing space so if you're if it's an ad you build and you explain the product yourself of course as long as you try and speak as clearly as possible when you're recording your videos that way you will have little or no corrections to make here right but if you do have corrections just make them save them and once you're done your final video of course don't forget to use the correct aspect ratio our video was square so i just use this one to illustrate what the that you can change the different sizes but you have your square video so you make sure you position the subtitles you can actually change their position from the style you can see you can move it around right so you make sure it's on the lower part of 
of the video, right? So it doesn't get into the video itself and then become obscured, right? Once you're done with that, you save it. So your video will come out already with transcribed text. So even if someone plays your video ad on silent, they can still follow and know what it was you were talking about, what you were describing, the problem you were solving with your product, the offer you were making, right? So that's about it. Once this is done, you get an email notification telling you your video is ready for download and you just download it and boom, you're good to go. So that's it for you. If you have any questions, um, leave them in the group or leave them with Jonathan and I'll attend to them as soon as I get them, right? So our video is ready. Let me just download it so i show you what it looks like. So that's the video. So let's play it. I'm not sure what's wrong with the sound. I can hear the sound. But you can see that the video is working perfectly. But that's what the video is going to look like, right? So, um, so that's it. So I'll see you in the next video.